I'm just gonna start with no 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 and effing no. Anthem will not kill Destiny. The Division did not kill Destiny. Warframe did not kill Destiny. Monster Hunter did not kill Destiny. And I will give you my reasons within this video why I believe Anthem will not kill Destiny. Destiny. Damn, I just wish people could just play more than one game instead of having to take sides and hating everything else. Jeez. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel, and I appreciate you being here. Today, I bring you my honest opinion on all this BS with Anthem is going to kill Destiny, or Anthem will suck because it's just a mixture of Warframe, Destiny, and Monster Hunter. Blah, 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 blah. But before we go any further, guys, if you do enjoy the video and would like to show your support, you can by hitting that like button. And if you are new around here and you enjoy daily Destiny 2 videos and Anthem 2, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so super recently, I got to play the full game of Anthem, not the VIP demo with all the login, frame rate, glitchy, rubber banding issues, but the full game, and it was truly flawless. Yes, many issues with the VIP demo is due to the actual servers not being as polished as they should be. But in actual fact, the issues I am witnessing people are having are ones Bioware could fix within a short period of time. I expect the demo, which should come out again this next weekend, to be much more polished. Now, what I've seen people saying, those who have got into the game and actually played it for hours, is that they truly love the game and it has the potential of being something absolutely amazing. I fully agree with this statement. After playing the full game for almost a day, I fell in love with it. It's amazing, it's incredible. The open world full of things to explore, the grind, the combat, the javelins and how they all offer such unique qualities and just the overall feel of the game. It's amazing, I love it, it's great. What I don't like is how I'm seeing people state it's a destiny killer. I mean, why can't people just play both games and enjoy both? If one game's overall better, that's fine. That doesn't mean you need to stop playing the other. I'm seeing many comments on my recent videos, my Anthem videos in particular, of people saying I'm unsubbing because I came here for Destiny. Or have you moved on from Destiny and will you only be covering Anthem now? Will I still post Destiny videos when Anthem drops? Of course I will be people. Destiny is my game guys. Anthem will be my game too. I plan to play and post both. Why is that so hard for people to understand? Allocating your channel to a single game is the worst thing you can do. I've done that for almost all of my YouTube career and yeah for sure there are some great times indeed but when that one particular game you cover falls off the radar and drops into a dry period the channel seriously suffers. And when many content creators who depend on such games which become slow and fall off the radar it seriously affects them and their channel. Anthem is a game I will 100% be covering. If you can't take that and understand what I've just said, then leave now, no hard feelings. But if you support such content creators, no matter the games they post, you are the true legends. So I am seeing many videos of people comparing Anthem to Destiny, which is okay. The games are similar, but not to the extent people are saying. Anthem, although okay, we have a game in which we shoot monsters, they drop loot, and we use that loot to level up, that's fair enough. But that doesn't mean anything when you play it. Anthem feels miles different to Destiny, down to the very core mechanics. Anyone who has played it will agree. Because the base reward system is similar, it doesn't mean the game is a direct clone, as I'm seeing many people state. They feel miles apart. If anything, Anthem feels more like Warframe, with how fluent it is, with the combat system reminiscent of Monster Hunter. And I'd say the loot system more so like the Division. But that doesn't matter at all, people will still compare the two. And if I had to say it, I'd say both have benefits, the others don't. Within Anthem, you can't change your loadout while in a mission, and you have to return to either Fort Tarsis or the Forge area to change your loadout, even when you receive that new endgame or loot. Destiny is a lackluster in customization, no matter the amount of shaders and armors you can unlock, you'll always see Guardians looking exactly the same. That's an issue you won't see in Anthem as you don't level up via the armor you wear, so you can look how you want the entire process, and these are just a few instances where one is better than the other in one particular fashion. And there are hundreds of these demonstrations, I could take this video away over 10 minutes if I wanted to, but I'm not like that. After playing Anthem for so, so long, I did think to myself, this is everything Destiny should be. But in thinking that, right now, Destiny is a game which has been around for many, many years and it hasn't really evolved. Anthem is a brand new game 
Bioware, you can tell, has taken the amazing core elements from these other games and rolled them into one singular game. And it's worked. Anthem is great. It's massive. It has that loot system you crave for. It has a great story and has great combat flying and overall mechanics. They feel amazing. It has the potential to blow everything else out the water. But will it kill games such as Destiny? In my opinion, no it won't. What it will do is give Bungie a good kick up the ass to give us better content. That is what I truly believe. Whether that's with Destiny 2 or Destiny 3 or whatever else comes from Bungie. Games such as Anthem and the fact they are closely compared to Destiny, in my opinion, is a good thing. It will make Bungie pick up their own game. And let's face it, Destiny has a fan base. Bioware are praying Anthem will get. Destiny will always have that stamp in the gaming world. It's already succeeded. It's already reached that peak. Many game developers dream their game will reach. Destiny will always have a place in the hearts of many, many gamers. And games like Anthem will never kill that. Anthem is going to be a great game, that is for sure. One I will pour many, many hours into and post loads of videos on. But Destiny is also a game I will continue to pour many, many hours in. And I will continue to post many, many videos on. And it is as simple as that, guys. Play both, enjoy both. And on that note, guys, we have come to the end of the video. Let me know your opinion on all this down below in that comment section. If you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really does help out. If you're new around here and this is what you would like to see, be sure to subscribe. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.